Hello everyone, welcome back to Quest for Glory, Dragonfire. Um... We got stuff to do, I think. I don't know. For some reason it's really quiet. It's kind of freaking me out. Okay, what we're going to do today, I really don't know. So, let's run around and do stuff. But, wait, I don't know what we're going to... Oh yeah, we'll turn in our uh, Rite of Destiny. Because we did do that the other day, didn't we? Alright, yeah. Victory! Let me... Oh, I hate that sound. Change out the money for the destiny token. We will notify Glogos that you have completed the rite of destiny. Oh, I have completed the rite of destiny. The web of the future is woven, and few dare to face what the fates have sown. One man has looked upon his future. The Prince of Shatir knows now what lies before him, for better or for worse. Thus ends the rite of destiny. Yep. That happened. You are dismissed, then you come back. Ah, oh, boy. Uh, that always annoys people. I have said before that a ruler must be willing to face death for his kingdom. A king must be willing to go through hell if that is what it takes to make certain Silmaria is safe. You too must enter the depths of death. You must open the gates of the underworld. You must face the fearsome guardian of the dark reaches, Cerberus. You must journey downward to the very center of the abyss. Enter the realm of Hades. Find the river Styx, with which even gods swear oaths of binding. Return from this infernal land to the water of the Styx to swear your honor and valor. This is the rite of courage. We're going to the underworld, the underworld. Okay, I need to stop singing sometimes. Okay. Well, with this information, I'm going to have to pull up a guide because I am not sure what to do because there is, like I said, a specific thing I need to do. Okay. So, the right of courage. Right? That's what we're doing now? Alright, so it says we need to... Oh, just noticed our mystic magnets are not where they belong. Oh, and we have the Black Lotus. We need to head to... to yeah, we forgot to give the Black Lotus to our apothecary friend. So let's go do that now, and then we'll head to our room. Because there's something we need to pick up there. Do I have chocolate? Yes, I have chocolates. Okay. I need flowers, though, so let's go ahead and pick some flowers. There we go. Pretty, pretty posies. We got some pretty posies. Good to see you again. Uh, do I give it to Jolinar? So this yes. is the fabled Black Lotus Blossom. I am told that it is a potent source of mana, although it can also be a deadly poison. If the lotus is indeed the main ingredient of the assassin's poison, Salim should be able to use this one to make an antidote. Awesome. Uh, nope, don't need to talk about that. Oh yeah, tell about Orestes. Orestes lost his arm at sea. I will try to help him with my healing arts. There we go. Basically, what I did by telling her about Orestes was gain points, which I now have the ability to awe people. 
Oh. Oh. Okay. But I also have holy strength. Yeah. Ah, uh, paladin abilities are so much fun. Uh, let us head back to our room, because I believe we need to go there. Yes, look, there's a box of chocolates on our thing. Why would there be a box of chocolates? Huh, that's a funny looking box of chocolates. Let's see what it says about those box of chocolates. I wonder why this box of chocolate is purple instead of that. This candy has odor of overripe fruit. Alright. And now we go back to the apothecary. Oh, hey, Orestes is back. You got your arm back, dude? Hey, I gotta thank you. That healer babe came by and fixed my arm as good as new. She said you sent her to me. You're a real first mate, lad. I'll soon be sailing out of here. It's nice to see you again. That healer is a swell lass. It's as good as it ever was, thanks to you. I made a deal with that centaur who runs the city. Gonna start a locksmith shop in my own town. Pay off me debt to Samaria with cash, instead of wasting away in jail me whole life. I'll, I'll remember that. Never thought. Well, if I'll never see you again, you know I'll never forget you. Good day to you. Good luck. Oh, there we go. Orestes' little circle of misdeeds and stuff has been completely corrected. It took out the whole thief storyline from us, but that's all that happens anyway. Good to see you again. All right, Jolidar. I got Candy these weird chocolates. For me? Thank you. You quickly explain that you suspect the kit chocolates may have been drugged. Oh, I am glad you brought this to us. Salim and I may be able to find out how to cure the effects of the drug, now that we have a sample. Awesome. And says we should buy some new poison cure pills. Hey, thanks. I'm not too worried about the poison. Uh... And then we go talk to people, and we need a... Well, I already have a hero. Uh, I have the Chocolat. And I believe I have enough Empora. Yeah, I have two Empora. Hero. Ah, I need pizza. And let's get us an extra box of chocolate while we're shopping for food. Oh, friend of my. All right. Yep. May your ma May your. May your. Just so I'm safe, I'm gonna take ten of those. May your. All right, and it says I need to talk to our gruff centaur shopkeeper. Sorry, I burped. Uh, talk about the right All of courage. Run to Hades, I hear tell. You find where the river runs with blood, and you can open the gates to the underworld. You're always welcome to enter in, but you'll never get out again alive. That's according to the legend. Well, thank you. It's been nice doing business with you. It's been nice doing business with you. Oh, the reason we got food of three different types or well, we're facing Cerberus. To quell Cerberus, we're going to feed Cerberus food. Tell me, uh, let's hear another There's name. something from my past you might know a bit about. Went to brunch with Baba Yaga, so I did not dare to eat. Had a queasy sort of feeling when I looked upon the meat. She called me Sweet Prince Ivan as she licked her lips for tea. So quickly I deserted, ere she made dessert of me. Ah ha ha ha. I don't get it. They are really making you work for this rulership, right? 
Hades thinks they didn't want you to come back from Hades. Hades? <gasps> That's one place I've never wanted to visit. My buddy Orpheus went looking for his wife there once. He was never quite the same afterwards. On the way to Hades, he met Cerberus, the three-headed dog of the underworld. Orpheus charmed him with a song, but then Orpheus charmed everyone. Orpheus almost drank from the river Lethe, which makes you forget all worries and rest peacefully. But Orpheus was goal-oriented and wanted his wife back from the underworld. Didn't get her out, though. According to legends, all streams and rivers that run into the earth flow oh, all yeah, the way we down already to know Hades. This one. To open a path to Hades, pour blood mixed with water into the hole. Then you got a chant something or other, but I never learned the words. Never really intend to go there, you see. You got the nerve to break. All right. He mentioned Orpheus. What happened with Orpheus was that he looked after his wife, as mentioned before. Uh, I believe he was told that he could leave with his wife if he did not look back while leaving to make sure she was there. I could be getting this confused with Morpheus, but I'm pretty sure it's Orpheus. Because Morpheus is the sleepy one. Uh, but yeah. But in his vain attempt to make sure his wife was behind him, he was mere feet from leaving the underworld. He turned back and phew, she was pulled back into the grips of the underworld. So that's what happened. It's a fun tale. You should actually read or look up the actual tell. It's very interesting. Let's go find out what else we're supposed to believe. We'll leave. Uh, what else we're supposed to do? Ooh, what is this? Examine the body. Although the blood out of the pillar shards has not yet faded, the corpse of the Samarian guard is already rotting away. You cannot see much of left of the face or identity of the corpse. He is already cold and stiff as a gravestone. Nothing of value. Although you swear that the body cannot have been here very long, it is already decayed and the water has removed anything. Uh, leave the corpse alone. Alright. Uh, I think Okay, first of all I need another amphora. Okay. And Believe if I pour the water in here, we will have Cerberus arrive. Through words of Delphi, all waters that flow in the earth flow to Hades. Alas, all life soon flows there to where the waters are, blah, blah, blah. That's why we read that, uh... Ooh. 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 Ah! Oh, oh, ah. You know in your soul that you have opened a gateway into extreme danger, and my nose is bugging the heck out of me. Ah, Cerberus! Welcome to Hades. I am Cerberus, guardian of the gate. I make certain no dead shall leave Hades. I make certain no living enter Hades. Can I interest you in a snack? How you doing? You are not welcome here. I have been since the dawn of time. Good, good. I will be until the dusk of eternity. Wow. Hades, the souls no one alive shall... Oh, sure. I've heard that before. All I want is a little Styx water. I won't bother anything else. 
Then they try to bring someone back to life. You don't fool me. Yeah. You won't get past me unless you first die. Or come up with a suitable bribe. Bribe? Bribe. Go! And do not attempt to enter here until you are dead! Or have a bribe! Because you need to bribe us! Now that's what I call a bribe! It's got cucumber! I'll be burping all night! It's got onion! It's bad enough living with your dog breath! Share and share alike! You got something better than that for me? What about me? Don't I get a yummy bribe? Well, I get to throw a pizza? Mm. Now that's what I call a bribe. That greasy thing? Yuck! I'm going to have indigestion, you realize? What about me? Don't I get a yummy bribe? And the last one. Now this is what I call a bribe. Hey, that stuff is bad for dogs. I'm immortal. It's bad for the teeth. No, it's so not. I've got a sweet tooth. So sue me. Not bad. Mmm. Savory. Melts in the mouth. All right. I'm satisfied. You can enter. But you may not be able to leave. At least your soul won't have far to go. Are we ready in a room at the Hotel California? Uh. I'm being attacked by shades. I could use a paladin spell of aura or awe. I wonder if that would work. Hold on. I got to try it. Oh. oh. Yeah, they were awed by my presence. I'm awe inspiring. Ah, puns. Okay. I am not sure which way to go. Okay. I need to decide. Okay. I died. Let's save here. And since I died, we're going to actually call this the end of the episode. Thank you so much for watching. Remember to like, comment, and subscribe. Until the next one, uh, later.